By now, you would have read the proposal that Marcus sent through, and perhaps you've seen Marcus's introductory video. So I'm to comment on the section in the summary about Christian formation. Truly, we are a mission that is called to fulfill uh, the four legacy words that David will be commenting on soon. Surely the vision of the waves of young people, the uh, Christian Magna Carta, the equipping people to take their place and produce God's kingdom and spheres of influence, as well as ending Bible property, is, uh, is definitely um, th those legacy words definitely catch uh, the breadth of who we are. But we are a people who are meant to know God as we make him known. We are a people that are meant to be reflecting um, who God is in the way we live and relate and work in the world. And we don't just become those people automatically or without intention. And so as we move forward in this university, we must, with intention, create environments, our bases, our campuses, our classrooms, our uh, places in which our outreach teams are going. We must equip leaders that are growing themselves in God and are better skilled at helping others grow. Now, we have all the components. God has spoken them to us. They're reflected in our values. They're reflected in some of our guidelines that we want for our U of N. But if we don't understand God's ways in shaping people, those things just become empty practices and they lose some of their shaping or their ability to shape. And so in the season, as we move forward, I'd like you to just um, um, have, a, ha have a question in your heart of um, how formative um, is your campus life? And are there ways that we could be strengthening the practices that happen on your base, strengthening your leaders in such a way that, that people are living more aware that God is present to us, that people are paying attention more to what's going on in their hearts and taking care of their hearts. And people are looking through the eyes, perhaps of Jesus, as they consider how to contribute to what he's doing in the world around us. Thank you.